What is long COVID? Well, it's a debilitating illness that lasts for at least eight months in most cases. The majority of sufferers from the first wave back in March are still not recovered. And the effects are severe. 93% of them are unable to go back to work in a normal capacity. Anyone can get it. It doesn't matter how young or fit you are. Children can get it too. Most cases had a relatively mild or moderate initial infection. Generally speaking, these weren't severe hospitalised cases, although they can suffer from long COVID too. It's really common. Research is split, but it happens to as many as one in four cases of COVID. The BBC here quote Professor Tim Spector's figures of there being 300,000 sufferers in the UK alone. No two people have quite the same experience. Waves of improvement followed by relapse are common. There is a huge range of symptoms. Fatigue is commonly cited as being one of the most debilitating. And here's why. It's not like just being tired. Imagine getting run over by a truck and then being chloroformed. Pushing through it or trying to exercise is a really bad idea. In most cases, it will trigger a bout of PEM, that's post-exertional malaise, and you'll be bedridden for days. Some small good news though, there is no evidence that long COVID is contagious. At the moment, we don't really know what's causing long COVID, but research is ongoing and there are a few theories starting to gather evidence. Want to know more? I discuss the latest science here and what the risk factors could be here. Thanks for watching.